All right, here's uh, my next boiler. And the boiler itself is a 20 inch diameter, 3 8 pipe. It's 32 inches tall and it has 22 and a half, 22 inch and a half copper tubes rolled in. There's a really nice three time whistle on it. I'll turn on the valve here. Really nice steam gauge. Pop off valve set it to go out about 120. I'll remove that valve when I know that this valve works properly. Really nice hand pump. One inch ram. This is your uh, water. Once you've got water coming out of there, you know all the air is out of the system. It's called an airlock valve. And now everything I pump goes right into the boiler. Even at 100 pounds, 110 pounds, it still pumps very easily. Uh, this is a, a quick disconnect uh, for a hose for filling it, brass, and then that's a blowdown valve as well. Beautiful water sight glass. Tricox. Uh, here is the lower valve. When I put new wood in, I always uh, turn it on for just a minute or so. You see how much air is moving through the fire. It gets the new wood burning really fast. Top of the stack is about 80 inches tall, total height of it. Engine out is back here, it's half inch. I have it reduced right now for a 3 8 to a 3 8, but I'm going to remove that. It looks like the valve in this whistle is good as well, so I'll remove this valve next. It's uh Rated for a four to five horsepower steam engine. I've just got it on one of my rolling carts here. Really nice boiler. I think this is at least 160 or so boilers that I've built of all different sizes. I'm just doing this size right now, 20 inch. My name is Ross, my number is 206-948-0770, and my email is anacortisteam, all one word, A-N-A-C-O-R-T-E-S-S-T-E-A-M, at gmail.com. Thanks for watching.